You already know what time it is. It's another episode of the Pastry Beer Cooking Show. And today, we're making another classic. Aki and corn pork and fried dumpling. Now, some people call it corn pork. Some people call it salted pork. It don't matter how you call it. That's what we're making. So the first part of this dish, we're going to soak our pork in water overnight. You know I'm a fan of soaking salted meat to get the salt out rather than cooking it. So normally I would soak the pork in the water and change the water every couple of hours. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to clean our pork up. So, so I just trimmed it up a little bit and cut it up. Now it's time to make the dumpling. Now fried dumpling is also called Johnny Cake. Today I'm gonna make it. Now we put flour, salt, I put sugar in mine, and a secret ingredient that I put in my Johnny Cake or fried dumpling is milk. Now what the milk does to this dish is, the milk acts as a lubricant to the gluten. Now the gluten is a protein that's found in the flour. Another trick that I learned is, when you're making the dough, you make the dough super soft. So instead of making it so hard like you're making a boiled dumpling, you make the dough softer and it gives you a lighter and a more softer fried dumpling. So after I make the dough, I let it rest for like two hours. Then the next step I'm gonna do, as you know, I like to switch things around. And I'm trying to use some of the techniques that I learned over the years to implement it in some of these Caribbean dishes. Instead of rolling the dumpling like they're normally done, I'm going to cut them out like a donut. So after I cut my dumpling out, I let them rest for another 20 minutes. Then I'm gonna fry them. Now, this is a trick I learned again. You don't have to fry the dumpling in hot oil. This is, I put my dumpling in my oil while it's cold and I just turn my flame on in medium and let it slowly come to a heat. By the time the oil gets to a hot temperature, the dumpling's almost done. You ever realize that sometimes you're making dumpling and when you fry it, the outside is brown but the inside is raw? That's why. Yeah your oil is too hot. So if you try this technique, it's definitely gonna help you. So the next thing we're gonna move to is making the ackee and the salted pork, or corn pork, as them call it at Jamaica. So I'm going to saute some onions and garlic. I'm going to add thyme and I'm going to let that cook for a little bit. I add my pork to my dish. I had some red onions and then I add my ackee. saute that for a little bit. I had the black pepper because the black pepper is what brings the flavor up of the ackee. Put a little bit of salt and let it simmer for a little bit. time to plate up this dish so I don't think I gotta tell you because from my previous video you realize that I'm cooking classic meals but I'm 
giving them a modern presentation. So let's get into it. I'd like to thank you for watching the Page to Beer Cooking Show. And please remember to like, subscribe, and share. And follow me on Instagram at, at Chef W. Murdoch or Page to Beer TV. And grab some of my gears. I got a lot of stuff on sale. I got food tweezers, I got pastry molds. And please remember to check out my pod. Page to Beer TV. Big